Buckle up, folks. I'm calling it. The 1997 Masters was less of a golf tournament and more of a Tiger Woods show. Let's dive into this golfing fiesta with a vibe only Tiger could bring. Imagine a 21-year-old Tiger strutting into Augusta, probably thinking, golf's cool, but have you tried winning the Masters as a rookie? After a warm-up worthy of a suspense thriller, he decides being four over is too mainstream, flips the script, and dances his way to a record-smashing, jaw-dropping 18 under par. And get this, he didn't just win, he turned the golf world upside down by a whopping 12 strokes. Like, whoops, did I do that? Yes, Tiger, you did, and you changed golf forever while you were at it. Breaking barriers like they were made of sugar glass, he wasn't just the youngest, but also the first non-white player to don that iconic green jacket. Suddenly, everyone wanted a piece of golf, and it's all thanks to Woods making it look like a walk in the park, which, to him, it probably was. Fast forward to now, and it's clear, Tiger Woods didn't just win the Masters. He owned it and reshaped golf into a blockbuster movie where he's the undisputed hero. So let's raise a club, folks, for the legend who made golf cooler than the other side of the pillow. And if you dig tales of domination and revolution, smash that like button like Tiger smashes barriers and subscribe for more golfing sagas that'll make you want to hit the links and maybe, just maybe, find your inner tiger. Smash, like, and subscribe in the most golf-appropriate way possible, quietly, as if you're about to hit the winning putt, but with the enthusiasm of Tiger Woods winning the Masters.